month, God has laid an exciting word for us in the month of September. Let us begin with a word of prayer. Holy Spirit, I yield to you. Let your people hear you, not me, Holy Spirit. Let them hear you through me. In the name of Jesus, Lord, in the mighty name of Jesus, minister to the hearts of your people. Let this be a word of confirmation, a word of affirmation, a word that will launch somebody into the next season of their lives. I declare it, I decree it, I release it. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. Amen, beloveds, the prophetic word that the Holy Spirit has given me to release for the month of September is bypass anointing. God says bypass anointing shall be your portion in the month of September. All systems will bow to the name of Jesus. Bypass anointing, said the Lord, and all systems will bow to the name of Jesus. Labo shiktim. Now the noun for the word bypass, this is the example that they gave. A route passing through a town's main road, providing an alternative route to avoid traffic. God is causing you to bypass traffic and go straight to the top. Labo City. I'm going to say that again. God is going to allow you to bypass the traffic and go straight to the top. Labo City. When you look at Genesis 41, Abo City, Joseph was asked to go to the palace. He, he was summoned to go to the palace. And after he got there and he, he was able to interpret the dreams because God had given him prophetic dream interpretation as well as strategies. So he gave him prophetic dream interpretation as well as divine words of knowledge giving divine strategies. Verse level shit, take him, shit him. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Verse 45, can we find a man like this in whom the spirit of the Lord dwells? Then Pharaoh said, where can we find a man like this in whom the spirit of the Lord dwells? Therefore, he appointed Joseph on the spot. Joseph had a bypass anointing. He was a appointed on the spot. He bypassed the interview process and went straight to the top. God is saying there are some of you, he is taken to the top. You are about to bypass the red tape, bypass the interview, bypass certain processes because you have been in the wilderness for so long. So many of you are Davids, are Josephs, and God is taking you out of the pit, out of the pit and out of the field, out of hiding, Lebo City. God hid you for a season, and now he is going to give you bypass anointing to take you straight to the top. Lebo City. Malachi 3 verse 16 says, The scroll of remembrance has been taken out. Mm. Thus said the Lord that the scroll of remembrance has been taken out. Every tear Every prayer has been recorded on it. And God says, now is the time for manifestation. God is going to open up some doors for you and you are going to bypass. Joseph didn't know anybody there. He told some people, hey, you know, remember my name, remember my name. But they didn't. But God caused a crisis where his name had to be mentioned. Labo said him. Some people are going to mention your name, whether they like it or not. And God will cause them to remember you. And when that happens, God is going to make sure, Marabo said him, that you bypass the red tape. All protocols will be broken for your sake, saith the Lord. Labo said him. For those of you who have submitted proposals, uh, God is saying you will bypass. Uh, you will bypass that process. Uh, God is saying that your proposal is approved. That loan is approved. That job approved. That court verdict, the ruling is in your favor. That visa approved. God is ruling in your favor. You are bypassing. You are bypassing the red tape. God is breaking protocols for your sake. Mm. 
Mabosete. Amos 9 15. The message translation. It won't be long now, saith the Lord. Things are going to be happening so fast. Your head will swim. God has been speaking to me extensively about suddenly. Uh, God is going to accelerate some things. There are kingdom marriages that are coming forth. There are people that God is going to appoint in high positions that are coming from the back. The Bible says that the last shall be the first. This is the time. The last will be the first because God is going to allow you to bypass. Oh, he will break uh, protocols for your sake. Mm. So that you go from the back straight to the front. Mm. Because you are ripe and ready. The wilderness season was to strengthen you. People think that David went and just killed Goliath. No, he had a CV. He had an experience with God. He had been through some things. And then God appointed him straight to the top when the time came. And God is saying the time is now. Oh, Bobo Shete. Thank you, Holy Spirit. God is saying he is cutting the red tape and he is breaking protocols for your sake in the mighty name of Jesus. This is your season. This is your time of bypox anointing. Things are happening quickly. God is saying he's opening up various things all at once. So he'll be opening up the job. He'll be opening up that proposal, opening up for you to go and present uh, your idea to major stakeholders, uh, opening up that door in television. Mm. For those of you in broadcasting, God will open up the doors in television. Yes, God says he has given us dominion to go rule. And rain. This is the time. The time is now. Those of you who've been waiting for your kingdom marriage, God is bringing things together now. God is by the bypass anointing on your life will cause you to skip the red tape. And God will take you straight to the front, straight to where He needs you to be right now. There is an anointing of divine acceleration. There is an anointing of divine acceleration thank you holy spirit thank you for this bypass anointing thank you for divine acceleration thank you for the testimonies that are coming from this word thank you holy spirit it is done in the mighty name of jesus i prophesy it i declare it i decree it i release it in jesus name amen Whew, thank you jesus thank you jesus God bless you, beloveds. God bless you. God bless you. All my information is in the description box. For prayer request testimony, my email is in the description box. If you'd like a one-on-one, -on -one, my email is in the description box. If you are led to sow, my information is in the description box. God richly bless you, beloveds. Shalom.